In this episode of King's Quest 3 to Air's Human Walkthrough, I show you how Widian can create magic sleep powder using the slumber spell. Stay tuned. VideoGamersOasis.com Play Subscribe This episode of Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater is brought to you by Feature Points Get free gift cards Games And much more Try free apps Get rewards Go to your iOS or Android browsers And type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash f e a t u dot r e forward slash v g o use the app start reaping the rewards with a continuation of our adventure on king's quest 3 to Eris human i'm your host the make geek and uh if you've been following my videos so far we just defeated the sinister man and we transformed him into a black cat and now he's helpless he cannot defeat uh, alexander AKA Gwydion anymore. Gwydion can, can now uh, walk around his house in peace and plan for his escape and work on his victory because he's got to save his family from sinister forces. So let's continue our hero's adventure here. We're nearing the end, end of this adventure, so let's see where we can go now. Restore the game. Now we're going to pause for a moment. Look at our manual here on my cell phone. So we just turned Manon into a kitty, now Gwydion is finally free of the evil wizard, but we still have some more spells to do. Save your game and return to the room, your room for your stuff. Go back to Manan's basement. Alright. We need to go back to Manan's basement. Um, get our stuff, retrieve. Um, take all. Alright, I think... Jeez. Oh, is meant. Um, where's Manannan's uh, lab? State replace. All right, we got everything we need. Let's go to the lab. I'm hoping we don't have run out of time. I don't know why we would have, we'd have problems with time because Manannan is defeated. So let's get moving already. Probably some other evil forces we have to contend with later on. Alright. Let's open up the gate. You quickly Let's pull the levers in the correct lever. sequence. In the correct sequence. Excellent. And let's open up the, the locker. Get the magic uh, wand. You try to turn the handle, but the door is locked. Yes, it would help to have a key. That would help mostly. So open up the door with the key. You unlock the oak cabinet using the brass key. Okay. Get the inside. Uh, you find the wizard's magic wand. Yes. Go downstairs. Going upstairs to Manan's lab. Take it easy. Okay, in Manan's lab. Save our progress. Alright. Now, next step. Where are we? Free of the evil wizard, but we still have some more spells to do. Go to Manan's basement. Next spe uh, spell is the Deep Slumber spell. Flip open the book, the spell book, to the said spell. Deep Slumber spell. Okay. Let's open the Deep Slumber spell. This is the first. Keep looking. Causing a deep sleep. 
save as as um, replace that as deep slumber deep slumber spell okay now ah <sighs> Flip open the book to the said spell. Now open the inventory. Choose the acorns you found earlier and exit the spell book. Find the acorns. The three acorns are dry and brittle. Alright. And close the spell so. Now what? <clears throat> Choose the acorns found earlier, exit the spell book, use the acorns on the mortar and pestle. Okay. You place the acorns in the mortar. Okay, we save that progress. Now. Switch to the hand cursor and use the mortar and pestle. You grind the acorns into a fine powder. Okay, save progress. What now? Open the inventory, choose the bowl, and use it on the mortar and pestle to get the acorn powder. Get the bowl! On, use it on the acorn... Vessel. The vessel with the pestle! You carefully scoop the acorn powder okay. out of the mortar. You put the acorn powder into the bowl. Okay, save our progress. Slumber spell. Now. Flip open the spell book to set spell. Now open the inventory. Choose the acorn irons. Uh, <clears throat> mortar pestle, switch to the hand cursor and use the mortar pestle. Open the inventory, choose the bowl and use it on the mortar. And pestle to get the acorn powder. Open the inventory again. Choose the the right the nightshade and use it on the bowl. Where's the nightshade? The nightshade juice sloshes around inside the glass jar. Okay. Use it on the bowl. You pour one cup of nightshade juice into the bowl. Okay. Save progress. Now, acorns, pestle, bowl, nightshade juice, use it on the bowl, open the inventory a third time, choose the wooden spoon and use it on the bowl to stir up the contents. So we got to use up the, uh, the spoon on the bowl. You carefully stir the contents of the bowl. Alright, save progress. <clears throat> What's next? Stand cursor and here. Oh, ah, okay. Open the choose the bowl, use it on the use the nightshade on the bowl. Stir it up with the wooden uh, wooden spoon. Return to the maple screen. Switch to the hand cursor and use the brazier to the right. Okay, use, use, choose, okay, open the inventory, choose the bowl, and use it on the charcoal brazier. Brazier, okay. Use the, okay, use the bowl on the charcoal brazier. You need to light the charcoal brazier first. Okay. You light Let the it. charcoal brazier. All right, we, we did that part. Now we gotta put it, the bowl on the brazier. You place the bowl on the charcoal brazier. All right. You wait until the nightshade juice is almost gone. Okay. That damp, powdery substance remains behind in the bowl. All right. What's next? Ah, what do we do now? With the third, third drain goes a wood spoon. Return to the table screen. Switch to the hand cursor and use the brazier on the right. Open the inventory. Choose the bowl and use it on the charcoal brazier. 
Take the bowl on the, off the brazier, open the inventory, and switch to the hand cursor again. Take the bowl off the brazier. Okay, brazier. You remove the bowl from the charcoal brazier. All right. Now what we do? Open the bowl inventory. Choose the bowl and use it on the charcoal brazier. Take the bowl off the brazier. Open the inventory and switch to the hand cursor again. Click the bowl, use the mixture on the table. Click the bowl. You carefully remove the damp powder from the bowl. Okay. Wow, there's the damp powder, all right. <coughs> What's next? the hand cursor. I'll click the bowl. Use click the bowl. Use the mixture of the uh, the table and recite the spell. Okay, click the bowl. Use the mixture on the table. Okay, use the mixture on the table. You place the damp powder onto the tabletop. Okay, save progress. Use the mixture on the table and okay. Click the bowl. Use the mixture on the table. The bowl. Okay. Click the bowl. <coughs> Hard me got a little bit of phlegm in my throat. Ah! Oh no! Fell asleep. Not good. You shouldn't try making up your own spells. What did I do wrong here? <coughs> click the bowl, use the mixture on the table, and recite the spell. Use, <coughs> click the, use the mixture on the table and recite the spell on the spells book. Okay, recite the spell, nothing else to do. Here we go. With trepidation, you prepare to recite the Causing a Deep Sleep incantation. Acorn, nightshade, together mixed. Concoction of a deep sleep fixed. Okay. From places of much lesser light, you bring to them a long good night. Okay. And after that... Now open the inventory for the wand. Use, use the wand on the mixture. Open the inventory again. A leather pouch. All right. Oh, magic wand. Where are you? You wave the magic wand over the powder. Okay. Now where's the pouch? You eagerly peek inside the soft leather coin purse and discover it contains some shiny gold coins. You may want to count them. Damn it! Messed it up. You shouldn't try making up your Okay. Where's my magic wand again? I skipped a step there. I skipped it. You shouldn't try making up your Okay. The instructions say Boil the mixture until the nightshade juice is almost caught. Remove the mixture from the heat. Spread the mixture on the table and wait until recite, recite the following. With trepidation, you prepare to recite the Causing a Deep Sleep incantation. Acorn nightshade together okay. mixed. Concoction of a deep sleep fixed. From places of much lesser light, you bring to them a long good night. Okay, wave the magic wand over the powder. Okay, we 
wave a magic wand, and then Go. We wave the magic wand over the powder. Okay, save our progress. Deep slumber spell, and now we get our pow uh, pouch. What's this say? This is a plain leather pouch, useful for yes. storing liquid or dry ingredients. Right now, it is empty. That's what we need. Not the gold purse. You carefully scoop up the powder from the table. With steady hands, you put the sleeping powder into the empty pouch. You now have a magical right. powder that will put anyone in the vicinity to sleep when poured on the ground in a place where there's both darkness and moisture. The charcoal okay. brazier burns out. Excellent. Now we got ourselves some magic powder. Deep slumber replaced with uh, um, magic sleep powder save replace and how are we doing now all right <clears throat> return to the table screen switch to the hand cursor use it on the charcoal brazier take the bowl of the brazier this time use the pouch and you got the nightshade powder next step is the brazier Next spell is the Brewing a Storm spell, but this one will need, you'll need some minor preparations. All, all we're missing is two ingredients, so leave the house and don't worry about not closing the trap door. Once it's once inside, warp back to this cave. Okay. Let's go back upstairs anyway. We don't have to worry about Mananan. Touching our uh, stuff or getting after us for the uh, magic wand. Let's go. Close our secret entrance there. You quickly pull the levers in the correct sequence. All right. Close that door, that locker. But we're not going to put away our magic wand just yet. The cabinet door locks as you shut it. All right. Save our progress. Magic sleep powder. And we want to warp to the cave. You rub the magic stone. Okay. You rub the magic stone. I don't want to go there. It's cool that I can transport. You rub the magic stone. That is neat, though. You rub the magic stone. All right. You rub the magic stone. If I didn't know better, I. It looks like I have in my possession the Philosopher's you Stone. You rub the magic stone. Okay. Let's see what our teleportation can do. You pull out your magic map. Okay. Let's go to our cave. You feel a strange pulling sensation. sensation. Okay. Save progress. Ah, save this as um, replace that with cave. And let's just see what exactly I'm supposed to do with this cave. Back to the cave. Cave. Use a spoon on the river to get some mud, next warp back to the village. Well, that's not the, the cave that we're looking for. You pull out your magic map. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the the area right here. The you bears, feel a strange the, the bears. pulling sensation.
There are the bears coming home. Okay, let's get get away from here. Let's get back to the cave by the by the river. All right, careful, watch out for the bandits. They may be around still. What's with the library? Oh, cool. Birds are talking. Library? Oh, you mean that derelict building in town? Huh. Yeah, no one ever goes in there. It's abandoned. <laughs> Why? Can't the townspeople read? Not since the last teacher left. When was that? About 50 years ago. Gee, it's hard to get teachers out to small towns. You said it. Wow. Those birds could be smarter than we think they are. Alright. Let's go this way, I think. There we go, there's the cave. And it might as well, since we're here, let's get some mud. Get a spoon. And fill it with mud. You can't, you. You can't. You can't, you, you, you. All right, what are we doing here? What are we doing here? Use a spoon on the river for some mud. You can't. A, a beautiful stream ripples through these stately trees. You splash some water on your face. Ah. You sp you sp I think I have to go further down here. You 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 can Nope, not there. Maybe back there. Further out up the cave. Okay. Now, let's try the spoon here. You can't. There we go. You kneel and scoop some of the mud onto the wooden spoon. Save our progress. Place that with muddy spoon. Muddy, muddy spoon. And we'll take a break because we've accomplished what we wanted to do. Save in progress, my spoon, rest place, yes. Take a break, yes. Gamers, I'd like to thank you for watching me play King's Quest 3 to Air is Human walkthrough. Uh, we were able to successfully create a slumber sp spell, and as a little bit of a bonus, I threw in a muddy spoon, uh, one of the ingredients I have to use for the next spell, the storm spell, I believe. Your host, Amiki, thanks for watching, gamers, and have a great day fun and extremely refreshing summer. Till next time, bye.